Yes, welcome back to our classroom. And we are moving on to the last topic in this chapter: magnetic effect of electric current. So far, we have discussed various things, right? How the magnetic field is produced with different different cases, and electric motors and electric generator, right? And move on to the the next one: the domestic electric circuit, which is uh, very resemblance to our house wire. Okay, right? And probably which is uh, related to electricity, not magnetism. right now move on to our topic and this one is a systematic diagram of a house wiring systems right and remember that this is a general rule here we have earth wire which is in always green in color the wire should be green in color for identification and this live wire is called so this red color wire is called live wire and this yellow one is called our black wire generally we are saying black wire here is yellow right this black color wire that is neutral wire so red is live wire black is neutral wire and green is earth wire so we have three different wires in our house wirings so all of the house wirings which is in parallel in connection i will say why it is parallel connection at the end of the session right okay now we have the two lines which is from the eb right this is electricity fuse from post to our electric meter in our home right in our house we have electricity meter right so this is electric pole and this is the our uh, eb meter right so the live wire is connected to our eb meter as well as the neutral wire also is connected to the our eb meter and remember that this earth wire is how we are making the sense we buried one small dick in that dick we are put some metal plate and uh, taking one copper wire from that we are applying giving uh, earth wire to the each and every appliances normally we are giving the earth which is for which is used in for high voltage for that case the appliance which is used in that used high voltage that time we are going for the earth wire right and so from that eb meter here we have the distribution boxes in our home you can see right some of mcb and the main line uh, main lines we have some phase adjustment right so that is here okay so which contains which is everything right this is a distribution box box containing and main switches and fuse for each and every circuit remember that this is available right now in your home you can see you have some drippers right that is we are saying mcb right that drippers are here only right from that dripper box only the circuit will be separated where and where it will goes right and here i have some connection here so here i have used three different black pins you know three different black pins right yes you can see so later i will show you the three different black pins this is remember that this circuit is always bigger in size because this is green color earth wire that should be exactly bit in shape right when compared to other two side so the live wire is connected to the one end and neutral wire is connected in the other end these three holes will not touch each other remember that these three connection will not touch with each other right and similarly i have connected these different switches maybe it may be bulb right and it may be tube light or it may be some other things so this is here for i draw for a bulb and for the low wire systems right but in our electric circuit contains two different circuits why the science we have high voltage appliances and low voltage appliances what is high voltage appliances yes we are using electric motor right to pump the water right and ac we are nowadays we are using and geyser we are using right those appliances are consuming more amount of voltage if it require more amount of voltage in the sense if consume more amount of voltage that means for that we need to provide high current that means in a house wirings we have two different circuits one is 15 ampere another one is 5 ampere current This 15 ampere current is used for geysers, AC, and electric motors, right? And 5 ampere current circuit is contains bulb and fan. So we are segregating into two different circuits in our house wiring. This is a typical diagram for one circuit, right? And here, what is earth wire? So earth wire is generally I said in the initial stage we buried with small deck. In that deck we have put some uh, some plate, right? Metal plate. from that metal plate we are taking one copper wire from that copper wire is connected to the our appliances at the body of the appliances 
once if it is any leakage of the current in that metallic body what will happen that metallic body of the appliances collect all those current and send it back to ground so we can avoid get shocking that is why we are saying that this earth wire is a safety measure so the metal plate deep in earth and it is a safety measure and which offers low resistance if if resistance is low means what will happen current is automatically easily go right so it can it should be a low resistance and any leakage of current of the metallic body of the appliance keeps its potential to the ground easily send to the ground so we are not getting any shock from that appliances right i hope you understand well thank you see you in the next video